Let me show you something interesting in PowerPoint. Let us go to shapes and pick up the line tool and I'm going to draw a slanting line like this. The width of this line can easily be found out by going to the drawing group in the shape format tab and then we can see the weight and it is one and a half points. So if I go to shape format and see the height, it should ideally be one and a half points. Why is it 3.49 centimeters? It is understandable that this is 15.66 centimeters, but why is the height 3.49 centimeters? Interestingly, the height here doesn't represent the width. It actually represents the height of this point compared to this point. So if I were to draw a straight line from this corner to this, then this height is what is represented by the height shown here. Now, what does that mean? At any point of time in my graphic, if I have a slanting line like this, and if I want to make it a perfectly horizontal line, I just need to select the line and then make the height as zero and hit enter. And instantly you can see that we have a straight line. The same thing holds good for even the vertical line. Let us go to the same lines tool and we have a vertical line like this. Now I'm going to make the width as zero and let us observe what happens. Zero and hit enter. Now I have a perfectly vertical line. So just when you thought that you have learned it all in PowerPoint, you learn these interesting aspects of PowerPoint. For more tutorials, come to Presentation Process YouTube channel.